Hey guys, Sean here. Hey, I figured I'd make a quick video on picking a picking the right belt for concealed carry. Um, some of us make a make the mistake of using just a cheap ten dollar belt from Walmart, which is not it's not going to keep the gun close to the body, and it's going to print. It's going to be more. It's going to be uncomfortable. Um, this right here is the Carhartt work belt, which I paid 20, 20 bucks for these, and this is a good option if you have a lighter firearm, or I mean, I mean, I even carried it with the MMP Compact the nine, which was like a brick on the hip compared to the MMP Shield that I carry. Um, but again, these they wear out faster. The leather it stretches. Um, you can never really get the right tightness around the belt. You know, you there's only so many holes. That are made in that are cut into the leather here so you, you find yourself having to punch more holes in and it's just it, it can be a pain it can be kind of a pain in the butt i mean some people have good luck with these it was okay for a while using the carhartt work belt um i wouldn't use some of the other belts out there that are just regular cheap belts um if you're going to go the cheap belt route from the store um the carhartt work belt works pretty good um it, it it'll It'll do until you get something better. Um, I'll get to that in a minute here. Um, there's so many different types of gun belts out there for concealed carry. Um, I've tried a, a few different ones myself, and um, some of them were crap, and they fell right apart. And um, the Carhartt work belt uh, worked pretty well for me, for the price, twenty bucks. You know, I mean, I, I wear one for a while, for six months, then I'll replace it with another one, and. It, after that because that, you know the leather stretches and it doesn't really you know once you start being able to fold this leather like this yeah it's not going to hold the firearm as good as it used to but um it'll it'll, it'll do the job probably not probably not i wouldn't recommend that really for open carry um but for for concealed carry inside the waistband um i mean for open carry outside the waistband i would not recommend this um but for inside the waistband it'll do for a while um, it'll, it'll just wear out faster and you could ever get the right, um, you can, I can never seem to find the right hole to put it in. Once I put the hole, put the, uh, I put it in the hole, then, um, it would stretch out and I would have to drill another hole in. So it, it, it was a pain in the butt. This right here is the Blackhawk. It's a duty belt. This is good for outside, if you can do outside the waistband a lot. Um, more, more so for at the range or for police duty, um. Uh, not really a good everyday concealed carry um, unless you have the right size um, pants because this is a two inch but you don't really need something like this for concealed carry I was just kind of putting this out here for a demonstration um, this is the Blackhawk the duty belt I think I paid like 30 bucks for this the Blackhawk um, great for a duty belt um, it's actually an inexpensive duty belt but I figured it's good to have never really use it except for at the range and this is what I use every day. This is the the 511 tactical. Um, this right here is awesome. I've been I've been wearing this belt since um, since June. And I tell you what, yeah, remember I said about finding the right hole to, to carry the gun in. Um, you don't have to worry about this. It's Velcro, so <laughs> this works out awesome. Plus, it's a good solid. It's 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 um it hasn't lost its um. Rigidity, it's um, still very sturdy, uh, very strong buckle on this, very, very, very strong buckle on this. The 511 Tactical, I believe this is the instructor belt. So this is a great, I, I highly recommend this over all these. You know, if you have to, yeah, you, you use a Carhartt work belt for a while, but definitely invest in something like this. I think this was like 50 bucks, 50, 60 dollars. I got this through Cabela's. Um, but there's so many other belts out there, guys, for concealed carry. Do not skimp when it comes to the belt. Um, I could go on the holster too, but that'll be for another video. But do not skimp when it comes to the belt. It is the very important part of the concealed carry system. So, anyways, that's the video. And hope you guys found this video somewhat enjoyable. And as always, be safe.